So I just got back from the gym and uh, it's time to eat. Today has been a busy day, but I've got my eggs and toast to eat. I already had my chicken tenderloins, already had my mince and rice. It's all done. Tonight, I filmed in a pretty busy anytime fitness, but you know what? The awkwardness wasn't there because in my mind tonight, I went in, I put my music in and no one else effing matters because I have, I have things I've got to do. I've got to bring you guys content and the people that like look over at you when you film shouldn't fucking matter at all because I'm helping people and what are they doing? They fucking go to a job they hate every day and I get to do this every day. So I just like went in there with the mindset tonight. I was like setting up my camera. There was a couple of weird looks, but you know what? I gave them a weird look too because I was like, fuck off. So I got in there, filmed the workout, which you'll see in this video and got it done. Hope you enjoy, watch the workout. Guys, give this video a thumbs up if you get value from it. If you enjoy the workout, make sure you subscribe to the channel because I am documenting this whole journey. I am 6.5 weeks out of my first bodybuilding comp and I feel freaking motivated as shit because my calories haven't dropped too much yet. But still, I feel great. I can look better because I've got 6.5 weeks to do so, but I'm ready. Here's the video. What's happening guys? Welcome to the new video. Logan Cole here and what better way to start a new week with an upper body push workout. So we've got some heavy bench press to go. What I did, I had to save a bit of time because I do actually have clients this morning. So I had about an hour and 10 minutes to finish this workout that sometimes takes up to two hours. So what I'll get you to do is look closely at the exercise name down below and it will show you what is supersetted. So if there's a1 and A2, that means they're supersetted. If it's say, for example, A1, then B1, then C1, they are all individual. So have a look at that. Look how I used these exercises to save time and look what ones I grouped together. I didn't actually overload muscle groups. I overloaded, I did the heavy set of say bench press and then would superset with leg press. So then neither of those actually affected the performance of the other one. So hope you enjoy the workout. If you haven't yet subscribed to the channel, this is episode, I think 11 of the series. And if you're new to the channel, make sure you follow my journey to my first bodybuilding comp. Just finished up with Brad, my last client of Monday afternoon. It is now 7.53 and I've driven myself to Anytime Fitness Caramel. And this is where I'll be doing my cardio. So I've got 30 minutes of cardio. I already had my chicken tenderloin, sweet potato and veg. Had that at like six. And I've still got one meal to have and it's like my eggs and English muffins. So I'm going to try and smash this cardio out. And then I will be on my way to Woolworths and do some shopping. I need to get some oats and stuff like that. So yeah, going to try and smash this out. Get into it. 
So post cardio, did my grocery shopping at Woolies. Just had to grab a couple of things. Um, got a couple of bags here as well as my training bag. Woolworths bags, training bag, bread, apples, banana. It's all there. I'm gonna try and do it in. I'm gonna try and do it in one hit. So obviously I'm gonna have to put the camera down, and we'll see how we go with that. But um, yeah, felt good. Um, I think I've done something to my my hamstring. It's like in the back here, in the back, just there, over to the side. I think I pulled it either doing sumos yesterday or hamstring curls today. I think it could have possibly been hamstring curls to be honest. Wait, no, hamstring curls were done yesterday. Today was leg extension. I didn't do it today. I must have done it yesterday and then it's kind of like flared up today. But it is quarter past nine now. I have to be up at four as usual. I suck at getting to bed on time. So I reckon bed at 10.30, up at four. Going to get Dylan to start running classes a bit more by himself. I'm gonna take like a back step and get him running classes, get him used to running classes because he's gonna be on the outdoor stuff and I want him to be able to handle it. So as of tomorrow, I'm just gonna take a back step, not gonna help him, um, not gonna help him set up, not gonna help him like ride it up on the whiteboard or anything like that. He's just gonna do it all himself and I just wanna see how he rolls because this is kind of like, He's like probation period I'm, and the eight week challenge will also be, I just want to see what he can accomplish. I'm pretty confident he's very reliable, but um, yeah, see how he goes. So I'm gonna get all this shit up there now. Okay, so up in the unit now, I've finally made it and I'm going to run through my shopping list for you guys. It's not everything that I have, but it is covering a lot of bases. So I'll start from the end here Instead of chocolate or anything like that, I've got some protein bars. There's 45 grams of protein in those, and they're on special, so grab some of those. These equals are tablets that go into coffee to sweeten it, an artificial sweetener. So I'll give you cancer, just be aware of that. And we have our long grain rice. This is actually lower calorie than uh, if it's gonna focus. I don't think it wants to focus. But um, this is lower calorie than like your jasmine rice or brown rice or anything like that. Just compare those. Um, I've got some oats that I put into my shake um, or protein pancakes as well. That's just what I use those for. I like to use the thicker ones to keep the protein pancakes nice and thick. Grab myself some pink lady apples, some toast that, oh well bread is not toasted yet, but I've got some bread so then I can have that with my eggs. Got some bananas also for my smoothies, protein pancakes, etc. I got some instant coffee because I want to start saving money and stop spending money on coffee. Um, taco seasoning for the win. I got a shitload of this because it was only a dollar a packet. So as you can see, got a lot of that there because I use it all the time. I use it all the time. I got some, did I just say I got that one? Some yogurt? The zero yogurt, this is lower, this is lower calorie than any of your like Chobani's, Yopra or anything like that. So if you're actually looking to shred down, the calories on this is pretty hectic if it wants to, there we go. Only 70, 71 calories per serving. So that's really good. I actually have my clusters with that, so that pops it over. But if you want to like freeze that and like make your ice cream out of it, that's only 71 calories per serving, so that's hectic. Um, I use coconut almond milk because the consistency of the coconut almond milk is a bit better than the normal almond milk. It doesn't seem to separate from like coffee and the shakes and stuff like that. It tastes pretty good. Obviously, I got my extra lean extra lean mints so i think that's like 160 calories per 250 which i have it at two for 15 dollars and it is the leanest form of mint you can get and then of course my eggs i bought three containers firstly because i hate running out of them so i just get three and uh cover my own ass with that that is my shop done obviously i've already got my tenderloin and sweet potato in the fridge. So that's all there. And sauce and like my fridge is actually pretty bare. I'm actually out of Pepsi Max at the moment. I'm gonna see how long I can go without it for. For like two seconds. I think there's one can in there. <laughs> I'm just joking. But um, yeah, I'm going to have some food now because it's 9.30 so 
See us tomorrow. It is currently 11 a.m. in the morning and I'm finally back to the unit after having morning clients, going out to Coldale, having my home base client there and then coming back for a one hour complimentary personal training session, which was awesome. Nice to meet you, Cara. She was an awesome chick. Um, and she went away with a lot and hopefully I'll see her back soon, but I'm finally getting to eat. I haven't eaten yet. Uh, as of this morning, I have been trying to save money on coffee. So I bought some Nescafe blend that I had this morning. And then I chuck a little like artificial sweetener equal thing in there as well. And yeah, it was all right. Save five bucks though. So, um, anyway, First meal, I need to get something in nice and quick. So what I have is my Yo Plate zero, zero fat, zero fat, zero sugar. No added sugar, no fat, no fat at all. So it's only, I think it's like 100 calories per serving. And then I just chuck some of my almonds clusters in there. Super quick little meal. And just got it in there, looks delicious. Weigh it all up as well. And then last night on special, I got a couple of these uh, Aussie, Aussie bodies, but these are actually really good. They're really good, but they're 370 calories. So I'm kind of wasting a couple of calories for the deliciousness. But um, yeah, gonna rip into that and uh, get on with my day. So as well as the yogurt and those Carmen's clusters with the yogurt and the bar, I also had two slices of just wholemeal toast with 15 grams of peanut butter on them. Because I was still hungry, so I had that. Made sure I weighed it out, weighed it out. And uh, now, I'm gonna go make the most of this sun outside because at the moment, the sun's there. And like, it's still covered by the roof slightly. And I've got like creep neighbors. Not that side, that side's creepy. And then up top, and then if you go out here, they can all like, you can all see me. And uh, yeah, oh, yesterday I was like laying out there and I like heard my neighbor sweeping and I was like, and then he stopped and I had my eyes closed and I was like, why do you stop? And I like look over and he's just like staring over his back at me. It's like, get, get, your, get your own, get your own son and body to look at. Fuck, so I'm gonna get out there. So just coming in now from outside and <sighs> probably running a little bit behind schedule today due to having the complimentary session run a bit over time. So I'm probably not going to train in the middle of the day. Usually I'd go down to definition today and but Riley's surfing so he's not going to be down there. I've got some things to do in regards to I've got a charity event on that I'm donating some stuff to so I need to get some vouchers sorted for that. I'm going to clean up the kitchen a little bit and probably have something else to eat and go do my cardio. I'll go do my cardio before going back to the gym. I've got a pretty big stint from two o'clock till about half past six. So big afternoons, well big days are really like Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday this week and then Thursday, Friday are gonna be my more spaced out days in the middle. So that's when I'll probably train down at definition. So glad I get to get outside and enjoy some of the finer things in life, like getting some sun on my skin though. I'm just gonna clean up and uh, yeah, probably also need to cook my mint for my meal prep. So let me get on to that too. So just finished my afternoon stint at the gym. It is now 6.39. I've eaten dinner. I've still got another meal to fit in and it's just my eggs and toast. So I'm gonna head, I haven't done my gym or cardio yet. So that's what I'm gonna head 
to Anytime Fitness and get done now. I had to do some computer work. I had to eat today, so I didn't have that much time. And I just thought it'd be easier to do it after my clients today. So, gonna get that done. Hopefully, not too late of a night tonight. I'll show you the workout as well. It's my full body pull workout, I think. Yeah, whatever it is. But yeah, get into that. Because I believe 